sun hasn't quite started peeking over the ridge line here. I can see it uh, hitting the mountain over here. So I'm uh, going to head up to Mount Dana this morning um, and uh, see what we can do up there. It's going to be a it's going to be a tough one because it's a heck of a climb. I'll put the the uh, chart and profile here. Take a look at that profile. It's a heck of a climb. So this thing's not going to activate itself. Let's get cracking. CQ, CQ, CQ. This is November 1, Charlie Lima Charlie. Summit's on the air. All right. Looking good so far. Um, it's currently whew, about 50 degrees. A little uh, cool, which is great to start out in. So I'll be warming up pretty quick. But uh, I'm told there's a basically a trail all the way to the top, although at the top looks like you lose it, but yeah, I'm not gonna get lost on this one. Oh, not that it would ever happen to me. Uh, Cause you know, my nickname is Wrong Way Claiborne. <laughs> you start out at almost 10,000 feet on this one and you go up to I think about 13. So, I'm expecting a pretty good climb. It's okay, I'll take my time and get it done. Pretty little body of water here. Great little sight on the way here. Where are you guys from? from the Bay, Area. Bay Area, okay. Cool. How about you? San Diego. San Diego? Yeah. How many days trip are you making? Okay, 11,020, not quite there yet, 2,000 feet to go, so probably a couple of miles too. Huh. Pretty much straight up, keep thinking I'm going to get to a ridge, that's not going to happen. Whew. But I feel great, really feel good, that's a gorgeous view. Alright, let's get going. Eleven thousand six hundred. Ah. This is friggin' awesome. I'm giddy with hypoxia. <laughs> ah, that's awesome. Really beautiful. I'm at the saddle here. Uh, between us, just a little, little bitty one here. But uh, God, some great views. Uh, first time hiking, I guess the second mountain, technically I'm down in the Sierras. First one was yesterday, so I'm pretty stoked. Oh, can't wait to get up there and make some contacts. And even considering that Gibbs over there, um, we'll see how I feel. That might be a good, a good second one for the day if it's not hot. Uh, it's nice and cool up here right now. Slight breeze. I'm in the sun, so that's gonna warm things up a little bit. Ham Ninja here with another Ham Ninja Yosemite tip. I guess this will be Yosemite tip number one. So, here it is. Stay away from the burritos in the Yosemite Valley store there. Uh, especially if you're hiking with friends. 
That's all I'm going to say about that. It's a flattened out bit here. About a 500 foot per mile climb rate, guessing. Uh, kind of pretty. Too bad it's not green, but nice view up here. Uh, above the tree line. And uh, yeah, good stuff. Nice song. Past 12,000. Uh, nothing but scree. Ooh, yeah. And, uh, you know, I got a really good pace. It's slow, but easy going, easy to keep up. And uh, glad I did some training. Because <laughs> my legs feel fine. Let's get cracking. Views just keep getting better. Swing around here. Give you one more shot. There's some other folks behind me coming up. So, Mount Dana's right up there. And uh, Gibbs is right behind it. So, be interesting to see if I can do that. Okay, you see the trail, right? I don't either. <laughs> so, it's kind of mixed in here. A uh, little bit slower going for me. I'm going to test... Yeah, you know, I test pretty much all these rocks before I really put a lot of weight in them. Uh, I don't need to be going down up here. So, that's all I'm going to say about that. I'll take a line up around here and to the left. Actually, it looks like uh, if I was going to put a trail in, that's what I'd do. I'm not going to go up this stuff. Anyway, let's get cracking. Oh, I found the trail again, luckily. Mainly because of that cairn there. I'm gonna tell you right now, this shit's a pain in the ass. Basically gotta test every step. Anyway. Almost there. I think I have about 500 feet to go. The Ham Ninja Channel. <laughs> we are at the summit. Um, Got to check out. Ashley's found the summit marker. The pin. Awesome. Right there. And uh, yeah, one hell of a view from up here. Holy mackerel! Um, I didn't. They don't want you flying drones up here, but you don't need one. This is really, really something. You don't have a sign of uh, Mount Dana, like 13,000. Yeah, Mount Dana 13K. You can bring it up next time. And your name? <laughs> Shilpa. Shilpa, welcome to the Ham Ninja channel. So, uh, medium traffic up here. Next channel. Uh, Next objective is to get uh, some photos and set up the set up the radio. This thing isn't going to activate itself. When you can't go up any higher, you know you're out there. Yes. Check out this drop off, guys. This is straight freaking down. That is cool. So, nine five. Um, set up on the mountain. I got my set, um, push up pole jammed up into the rocks up there, and uh, so I got nice height on it. Super light breeze, so as long as it doesn't blow any harder, I don't have to put my fleece on or anything. So, this will be my operating position. I brought my chair, I forgot to take it off of my pack <sighs> like a big idiot. So, uh, I'll sit on the rocks for a while, see how my butt does. <laughs> Uh, I'm the only goofball. I think I'll set the record for how much furniture I can bring to the summit. Next time I'll bring a table too. <laughs> Alright, let's get cracking.
CQ, CQ, CQ. This is November 1. Charlie Lima, Charlie calling CQ, CQ, CQ for Summits on the Air, any station, anywhere. November zero whiskey alpha echo got you five 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 five. Forty two into Montana. Thank you for the signal report and have an awesome day. Thank you for the information and you have a good time out there. QSL November one Charlie Lima Charlie summits on there. Uh, Whiskey 4 Kilo Radio November. Good morning, Karen. I uh, got you at about a 5-5, five, 5-5. Five, five, five. Okay, thanks a lot, Chris. You're a 3-by-3 here. 33 in Virginia. Victor Alpha, QSL. QSL, QSL, QSL. Thank you very much. And one CLC, are you there? Kilo 6 Yankee Kilo. Kilo 6 Yankee Kilo. Got you 5-5, five, 5-5. Five, five, five. Okay, very good. I was, I was thinking it was going to be like a 2-2 two -two there. <laughs> you're 5-3, 53, over. QSL, you're out of Bexley, 5-7 here, 5-7. Thanks for the contact, John. Okay, thanks, Chris. Man, I'll tell you, you're coming in great. 73, see you next time. Yeah, it's amazing what a 13,000-foot peak will do for you. Yeah, that, you're, you're only about maybe 110 miles from here or so. Yeah, okay, roger that. We got ground wave. Well, have an awesome day, John. This is November 1, Charlie Lima, Charlie, QRZ. Man, not a lot of takers on sideband today. I'll go on over to 40. Everybody have a great day. Well, that's it. Um, hiker came by and saw me sitting in my chair <laughs> kicking back he looked at me and he's you know i'm at 13,000 feet he's like who <laughs> who hauls a chair up here he looked at me and he's like you are my hero <laughs> that was pretty funny anyway i'm gonna head back down um got uh, several contacts uh oh, 35 QSOs. um three some of the summits that was pretty cool maybe a double in there but um a lot of fun up here um the bands were kind of like weird today um not real hopping but then i had guys coming in that were blowing my ears out so yeah good time up here the view is absolutely incredible and um <clears throat> yeah so it's time to head down i really just took my time on this one i was going to head over to gibbs but um which is just right across here but <clears throat> to get over there uh, it's gonna take a while and it's um kind of you know it's, it's noon now so it's not something i want to do by myself kind of going off trail and cruising over there save that one for another day and um see if i can't get down the hill safely here so there you have it. Let's get cracking. Alrighty. 35 contacts, three summit to summits. Beautiful hike. Fantastic weather. Um, light breeze coming down, so it kept me cool. And it was awesome. Really, really, really great hike. So if you're interested in learning more about how to do this hobby, I did a, a series on activating, chasing, um, and some other stuff. So check it out. You can find it at hamninja.com slash SOTA360, S-O-T-A 360. And there's a bunch of information and past hikes and stuff out on hamninja.com, as well as my full loadout. You'll see a link toward the top that says loadout. Anyway, thanks for watching. Don't forget to smash that like and subscribe to button make my ego even bigger because who doesn't want that <laughs> so um, I'm going to close it out here and let's roll the credits <laughs>